Hey everybody, Jim here with your daily dose of Japanese gaming goodness. It is the import game of the day, and today's game is Battle Garega for the Sega Saturn. This is a 1998 release that was developed and published by Rising, and while it's a rather rare and expensive game on the Sega Saturn, it did get a re-release on the PS4 and Xbox One in 2016 as part of the M2 Shot Triggers line of games, so whichever way works best for you, definitely play this one if you're a shooter fan because it's very good, as you might expect from Rising, who also developed some other favorites of mine like Bath Rider and Sokyu Gurentai. This game features kind of a steampunk motif, and it has you playing as two brothers who actually designed all of the enemy vehicles you'll be facing off against as the Federation is using them in a play for world domination, so it's their responsibility to use their secretly developed fighter planes to take down the Federation and save the world, though this story isn't really conveyed much in the game itself. So this is a vertically scrolling shooter that gives you four different ships to choose from with four more to unlock, and one thing that stands out about this game is that it is brutally difficult. A lot of shooters on the Saturn can be pretty tough, but this one makes it a point to be especially challenging as it features a progressive difficulty. Basically, the better you play, the more difficult the game becomes until it gets to a point of pure insanity, but when you lose a ship or two, the difficulty comes back down a bit. I wasn't aware of this at first, so you can imagine how frustrated I got until I realized that dying at strategic moments is the key to clearing this game. As you play, you'll pick up power-ups that give you up to four assist pods that increase your firepower, and they can be switched to five different configurations that are better suited to different areas of the game. You can also pick up little bomb power-ups that build up your arsenal of missiles to be used in a devastating super attack, but again, don't get overzealous with them or the game will decide to punish you. Overall, while it's super tough, this is definitely a very fun and addictive shooter that plays extremely well and I, for one, really enjoy it even if those tiny little bullets force me to strain my eyes. This is also a great looking and sounding game as per usual for Rising, fantastic visual design, and a very catchy soundtrack. So if you like your shooters tougher than a $2 steak, Battle Garega is a perfect choice. It's awesome. 